Welcome back. Lent Miners 4 0 in the season after a big one against Addicts last Saturday in Brownsburg. Tonight, Coach Hart and the Miners welcoming another undefeated team to Miner City. 3 0, Mitchell Blue Jackets. Nice crowd on hand. First play recording. How about Luke gets this? The inbounds play. Mitchell turns the ball into the hands of Joey Hart. You know what he does best. Wide open in transition. Flushes that one home. Miners up 7 4. Next bucket for Miner Town. Logan Webb comes off the screen, splits the defenders. Not once, but twice as nice for the nice finish. Linton goes up by five. They don't just score, they do it on defense as well. Nathan Frady gets the steal. He looks up the court to Webb. He is wide open. It looks like he tries to get an oop off the backboard. Hey, it doesn't work. That's still okay. Hart comes there to clean it up. Mitchell looking to close the gap. Senior Andrew Shepard would do just that. He gets by his defender, cuts through the paint, gets the floater to fall. One more for Miner City in the second quarter. Webb getting the double team, but finds Frady wide open from range. He sinks that. Miner's up 23 to 16. Linton would widen the margin. They get a big win, taking down the Blue Jackets 57 to 42, the final in Miner Country. Also in Greene County tonight, Shackamack hosting North Knox. Second quarter, Lakers down three, but not for long. Brady Yayer finds Will Miller in the corner for three. That ties it up at 16 on the night they honored the state finals baseball team. Next possession for them, Oscar Pegg comes off the dribble, stops, pulls up for the mid-range jumper. That gives the Lakers a lead under a minute to go in the half. Warriors letting the big man do the work. Cohen Williams gets the basket to fall for North Knox. Seconds winding down in the half. Shackamack looking for anything open. They find it at the top of the key with K. Kanye Wade, he hits the buzzer. He's so good, I can't even say his name correctly. They give them a three-point lead at the half. Warriors would answer the bell, though. They finish strong after rebound and transition. North Knox has the numbers. They find number three, Will Sloan, in the corner for three. That gives them the lead. And North Knox gets the win at Shackamack, 40-35, the final, Omar.